Hey everybody, so as always, Poppy P2 family, please check in down below. So, sorry if my voice sounds a little, uh, I guess, uh, beep or nasally here. Still kind of dealing with the cold, but hey, you know, figured today's a little special because, you know, it's New Year's Eve, so end of 2019 and uh, hello to 2020. And <coughs> so we figured, you know, we want to send 2019 out with a muck bang. And way else to do it, other than, as you guys were, as uh, you guys have voted here, so we decided we're going to Taco Bell. And now, another reason I guess why we're going to Taco Bell is because they just put three new tacos on their dollar menu. They brought back one, the double stack tacos, and so we have three varieties: they have nacho cheese, Reaper Ranch, and uh, the Chipotle Southwest. And they are, they're not only just $1 each if you want them by themselves, they also have uh, options to come in a box meal for like 5 or $7, which comes with a ch uh, Chalupa Supreme, and a drink, I think, come with, and they either come with a crunchy taco or a beefy 5 layer burrito. I got the $5 box, so we got a crunchy taco with that here, so, and, I think we'll do a little... A little review here of the whole meal, so. And also, a couple shout outs to some new supporters here, so. And, uh, I, no, I have to admit at first, you know, I figured these people, with the way they are, were, no offense here, I thought they weren't going to be true supporters or something like that. They were just, you know, coming here to, you know, basically waste the time and, you know, just basically cause drama and tick people off, so. But if you can once you get to know these people, it should be all good, so. So, shoutouts to YouTube Jared333 and Hopeless17. Let's also shout out to new subscriber uh, Jim Bean. So, because you guys asked for it and decided, you know, what for end of the year, might as well give in. I usually don't because I usually only shout out people who I feel, you know, deserve it to, and that's why I don't usually give out like shout outs that easy so but let's get in let's get in with the mukbang here so so of course I'm doing well first doing the Chalupa Supreme and of course as you see well, my favorite Diablo sauce. So. So, this is not bad at all. I figured I'd much rather have the Diablo sauce than the sour cream. And then, get into the, the regular crunchy taco. And then, because huh? we're saving the double stacks for my ass, so. Yeah. So. Now, as far as the double stacks go, right now, I have no idea which one's which. I probably should have asked maybe them on the outside. So. Hmm. Hmm. Yeah. Oh. 
Yeah, we're on to the double decker. Yeah, we do. Looks like this one should be the nacho crunch. See, this is one that was left the, on the outside uh, wrapper. So, yeah. Now, I know a lot of you fans probably would recognize that Taco Bell used to have the double decker taco. Which uh, is like a regular crunchy taco on the inside, and then on the outside, it's a. Uh, and then on the outside, they also put the soft taco shell. And in between the two shells, they would put like cheese sauce and like uh, refried beans or bean paste. But that is unfortunately gone. So now. So look at this one here the Nacho Crunch. It has the uh, nacho cheese sauce. Excuse me there. The nacho cheese sauce. And those red strips, which personally I never really like the red strips, so let's see if we got a plate for this time. Let's see here. Still red strips, eh, they just all bring color, but no flavor, so. Otherwise, right now, the Nacho Crunch, these are not bad for a dollar either way. I think the Nacho Crunch is going to get the lowest of the three for my score here. Mm -hmm. Got all the taste to it. So I'm not going to be too hard on it here. But I'm thinking the Nacho Crunch, I should give that. I'm gonna give that a seven. So if the red if the red strips had flavor, of course it'd be a high score. Mm. Now we try Chipotle cheddar, which has the cheddar there. Southwest Chipotle sauce, nacho cheese, as well here. It's a, those are usual taco uh, taco fillings. So. Sauce on this one. Mm. Oh. Mm. It's quit. So. Mm. so. Chipotle South the Southwest definitely gets an eight, so definitely better than the uh, Nacho Crunch.
Alright. And then now, the coveted Reaper Ranch. <laughs> Which is supposed to have a really spicy ranch dressing on it here. Plus the usual like nacho cheese sauce, beef, lettuce, and uh, and shredded cheese. So that's what it looks like. So let's take a bite out of this. So. Mm So, when you get that kick from the Reaper Ranch. Reaper Ranch is also pretty good. It is a little spicy. It's not as spicy as the name suggests, though. So. But, uh, but I figured I want to tie that with the uh, Chipotle Southwest. So, 8 out of 10 for this one as well. So. But we'll see, you know, when I definitely say, you know, go, like, you know, try Taco Bell's new double snack tacos, of course, you know, give it a try, you know, at least get the credit. And, uh, and not bad at all for a dollar. Hmm. Been probably all over the time only, so. Alright. So. Please let me know what you think in the comments down below. And, uh, as far as the New Year's resolution, you know, I definitely hope to grow this channel both on YouTube and Instagram TV. And, you know, we'll keep that support going here, so. Excuse me there. So, again, and don't forget to go check out YouTube Jared333, Hopeless17, and Jim B. I've linked, the link, I've linked to the channels in the description as well. You know, tell them I sent you. So, and that's it. I hope everybody has a happy and safe 2020. And, you know, has... You know, best of uh, best of luck in all your endeavors and whatever the future brings to you all here. Thank y'all so much for your support. Love you all here. Stay happy. Stay positive. Robbie P two out.